What is going on guys? Grave here. Welcome back to Modern Warfare. And it has been confirmed today by Activision that all post-launch maps and modes will be available on all platforms at the same time. So this is going to be the first time in a long time that everyone has been able to get like maps at the same time. It's usually either been exclusive just to Xbox so they would get them like a month early or up to a couple weeks early or vice versa. You know, the last several years has been PlayStation got all the maps first and all the new modes first and then they came to Xbox later and PC later. Well, this year, modes and maps will come to everyone at the same time. It says even though that the game is still a PlayStation kind of first style game, PlayStation will get some things first when it comes to modes and maps, everyone will get them at the same time. So that's really good news. I've always hated that some players get the maps on some platforms or consoles and some do not. They have to wait. I just not really, I've never really liked this idea at all, even back when I played on Xbox and it was PlayStation kind of getting screwed out of it, or now that I play on PlayStation and Xbox has been kind of getting screwed out of it. Um, either way, I think this is a good thing for all three platforms. So all three platforms will be able to play all the maps. I'm assuming this is probably to kind of do with the whole cross-platform idea. It's going to be hard to have a cross-platform game when people get maps at a different time. Now, with all of the, you know, maps kind of DLC idea being free and everyone get, getting them at the same time, this is really shaping up to be kind of a good DLC year, in my opinion. Now, I'm sure we'll still have microtransactions and things like that, but that uh, is going to have to be kind of another video. We haven't got all the confirmation on those things just yet. They did state in this article, I will link this down in the description below if you'd like to read over it yourself. They did uh, state, though, that PlayStation 4 uh, players will get something day one. They said they will get an advantage day one. I'm not sure what they really mean by this. They really didn't state exactly what this was going to be. I'm assuming PlayStation members are may maybe going to get some kind of double XP or something like that. I I'm not sure what they're going to be giving the PlayStation members. They said PlayStation members will still get things throughout, you know, the title's life cycle, you know, first for at least, I guess, the first year anyway, uh, because it is a PlayStation first kind of thing. I wish they would just do away with all of this just in general. I think they're going in the right direction by giving all the, you know, all the different platforms, all the different, you know, consoles and PC, uh, the maps. I wish they would just really do away with this whole idea of anybody getting anything before anyone else. I think if you pay for the game, you should always be able to get, you know, the items at the same time, no matter what you're playing on. But at least, like I said, it is a step in the right direction with the maps. Leave me a comment and let me know your thoughts about this because, you know, there's a lot of stuff going on around, kind of revolving around the game, you know, a lot of positive and, of course, a lot of negative things as well. You know, some people like it, some people don't. Some people want some changes in different areas. But overall, after playing the beta, you know, I'm an old school COD fan, played all the old, uh, old COD games, all the new COD games, been playing COD since it's been out. And it was, it was different to go back and play something, you know, it was kind of an older style game, but at the same time I did enjoy it. And I think it is shaping up to be a better experience overall, uh, for, you know, just everyone content wise with this announcement. So I think it's going to be a really good thing going forward. And hopefully all the, uh, COD titles in the future will kind of follow suit with this. And like I said, I'm sure it's something to do with this whole cross uh, platform idea. And if that is the case, hopefully it will eventually just get rid of this whole, idea that any platform should get anything before anybody else hopefully that will just eventually disappear in the upcoming years anyway guys like i said if you enjoyed it make sure you hit the like button if you haven't subscribed yet please do so and i'll catch you guys next time peace